Hello, hello, here at the upper end of the Geldingerdale lava field, the 2021 eruption. And uh, most of the lava in 21 was flowing downhill into the various va uh, valleys. But uh, here we are on the upper side and uh, there is the vents. Here's one of the vents. Over there is another one. And here we are at the edge of the lava field here on the upper hillside. And they're beautiful pohoi hoi textures, very glassy actually. It's crumbling now because people were stepping on it and uh, it's very fragile. So, see, it's uh, not got a high preservation potential, I'm afraid. So it's beautiful right now, but uh, it will not last. And here's one of these beautiful glassy surfaces. Let me just zoom in here. So uh, with little hairy bits, so thin hair, glassy hairs, the Pelé's hair kind of welded onto the surface. Fantastic material. And uh, just here you see the tongs, the... Uh, the little tongues of lava, how they have progressed over the surface here, coming to an end. And uh, this is a large lava field here, but it continues towards my right downhill. But uh, when we step up here, I can actually show you a little bit of the dimension of this, which is quite spectacular. But it's a little dangerous to walk on because many of these uh, crusts are very unstable. There's hollow bits underneath, but here you see the dimension of this. So there's quite a a large field here on the upper side of the Geldinger Dale area. So, thanks a lot and I hope you enjoyed that. So, uh, we sampled, we're just completing our sampling now. We're getting ready to go back and we're just packing up. And uh, this is it for now. And we're now we're going back having a routine check on the ongoing eruption now, which apparently has uh, again subsided a little bit overnight. So, it seems to get weaker. If no change occurs, this means the uh, final phase may have started. But we'll see, we'll have a look and I'll send a little report in a short while. Thanks, Emil. All the very best.